on this Thursday is uh, spe special function. It's related to all practitioners of yoga. It's uh, about Yogeshwara, Sri Krishna's uh, Ashtami. Sometimes it is celebrated as Janmashtami, sometimes it is celebrated as Krishna Jayanti. Janmashtami and uh, Jayanti, it's uh, two different uh, occasions. Janmashtami is uh, celebrated in the, when Krishna Janmashtami comes, it is the fifth month in the solar calendar, Mesha, Vrishabha, Mithuna, Karkataka, Simha. And it comes on the fifth month. Sometimes it coincides with the fifth month in the lunar calendar, Chaitra, Vaishaka, Jaista, Ashada, Shravana. Shravana, sometimes it coincides with that one, but it is always, it is on the fifth solar month. That it can come in Shravana or Badrapada, two months. It's uh, this time it is coming in the fifth solar month and the uh, lunar month coincides. It's in Shravana month it has come. Sometimes it, it can happen in Badrapada also. So Krishna Ashtami, Ashtami is the one on the fifth month, dark, dark fortnight. On uh, the eighth night, Ashtami, on that night, in the, at the midnight, if uh, Rohini, Rohini is there, the star, Rohini comes, Rohini constellation is there at that midnight, that is called as Krishna Jayanti. If Rohini shifts, it is not coming on that night, midnight, that is called as Krishna Ashtami. If the Rohini is there, Jayanti, if the Rohini shifts, it is called as Ashtami. This year, it is Krishna Ashtami. The Rohini, that star, comes on the following day. It's a Friday. It's Ashtami, it's a, and the midnight. It's a Krishna Ashtami on the Thursday. And uh, some people, they follow the star, but actually it's Ashtami on that night. If the star is there, Ashtami, if it flows to the next day, it is, uh, it is not Krishna it's a, together it is called as Jayanti. If it shifts, it is only Krishna Ashtami on Thursday night. Thursday night. And uh, it's a Yogeshwara in Bhagavad Gita. It talks about Yogeshwara, master of yoga. So we all uh, practitioners of yoga are indebted to Maha Yogeshwara. In the 11th chapter, Sri Krishna has been addressed as Maha Yogeshwaro Harihi. Maha Yogeshwara. It's a... Um, he, the, through the Bhagavad Gita, Bhagavad Gita Maha Yogeshwara, he g has given the yoga, it's a different dimensions, Karma Yoga, Bhakti Yoga, Raja Yoga, Jnana Yoga, and uh, it's a, your Bhagavad Gita is nothing but a psychotherapy. Look after your mind. Samatvam, we touched upon today, Samatvam Yoga Uchyate. However difficult is the situation, do not lose your mind. Do not get anger. Why you are getting angry? It is, uh, it asks uh, that one, that too, what is the purpose, that uh, if you are getting angry, you make a, make a question for yourself, why I am getting angry, make a self-inquiry self and make a record, make a diary, how many times a day you are getting angry, first how many times an hour, a hour you are getting angry, then slowly how many times a day, then how many times a week or how many times a month. Make a record for yourself and make an answer for yourself. Write an answer. Why I got angry? Make an answer. Shri Krishna talks about dhyayato vishayan pumsaha. Slowly, krodha, thinking of that one. Through the attachment, you get the anger. Slowly, he talks about that one. We'll try to cover that one in the coming classes. Why you are getting angry? It's a, gives a, it's a, for daily living, it gives a small tips how to be, how to maintain your balance, balance, don't lose your mind. And Karma Yoga, Bhakti, Raja Yoga, he talks about asana, how sh you should sit. Pranayama, he talks about pranayama, how you have to do the pranayama. It's a how to meditate, what is dhyana, what is the object of meditation. So it talks about in the Bhagavad Gita, that we all practitioners of yoga are indebted to Maha Yogeshwara. And the fasting on that day, it's a Krishna, Janma, uh, Krishna Ashtami, it's uh, equivalent to fasting on thousand Ekadashi day, it says. Try to fast. It's, uh, if it's difficult, if you, whatever medication, if you are on that one, try to reduce your intake. And, uh, and uh, it says, generally we think, 
without eating. Even doctor says you should eat every two hours or every one hour you should eat. But uh, we think the doctors say you have to eat to survive. But in the Upanishad says we die because of eating. And uh, people eat and eat, eat and, and die. And uh, it's a, try to stay away from the food. Say, see the lightness in the body, lightness in the mind. It's uh, at least on that day that you try to take your uh, intake down. It's uh, cut down the intake. And the Gopala, I t talked about, uh, it's a go, it's a, our Gomukhasana. Gopala, Gopala, Shri Krishna is called as Gopala. Go, Gopala means, uh, literal meaning is uh, looking after the cows. But more than that one, Go, Go means Jnana, knowledge. One who protects. His incarnation is mainly for giving the knowledge, knowledge to the community, knowledge to the generations. It's a knowledge, Go, Go means knowledge. One who protects the knowledge, one gives the knowledge. It's a knowledge, it's the many people that, uh, other day I saw one uh, person wearing a t-shirt, ignorance is bliss. And ignorance is not a bliss, knowledge is the bliss. Ignore ignorance, we get anger, we get confused. We, it says we suffer because of the ignorance. Knowledge liberates. Gopala, Gopala, no, knowledge. One who gives the knowledge to us and one who makes sh sh make sure that knowledge remains with us. That is Gopala. Gopala, we, are, uh, we need the knowledge. Knowledge is the real freedom. It's the, that's why in Bhagavad Gita, in the Dhyana Shloka, it says, Jnana Mudraya Krishnaya Jnana, through the giving, through giving the knowledge, he has, uh, he has uh, entire Bhagavad Gita has flowed by, it's uh, for the knowledge. It's a knowledge, he gives the knowledge, Gopala, Gopala is giving the knowledge for us. And uh, as a remembrance, as a sadhaks, we are a master of the yoga, Maha Yogeshwara, uh, it is called as uh, uh, Jagat Guru. Krishnam Vande Jagat Guru. He's a master of the, he's Guru's Guru. All the Gurus, he's the master. On that day, we remember the master of, uh, all the masters. Mahayogeshwara, on the Thursday, we let us uh, celebrate uh, uh, it's, uh, Krishna Ashtami, that uh, as a practitioners of yoga, we are indebted to our master. It's, uh, we have to remember that one, and we'll practice yoga, and uh, we'll uh, do the some pranayama.